Hi, hello, good evening, good day, students. Welcome to YRK's chemistry classes. This is YRK Mohan. My name is Krishna Mohan. I am uh, having uh, 20 years of experience in teaching chemistry. And particularly after the COVID, uh, I also started uh, some experiments like uh, giving these videos, YouTube videos, uploading and all. I hope you all like my classes. Please subscribe my classes if you are interested or inform to your friends who are studying class 11 and class 12. Interested for board chemistry classes or need chemistry classes, JD, CED classes. Please subscribe my classes. Okay. Now, I am going to just discuss a very small concept in this uh, CET examination on uh, oxides of this uh, uh, third period elements in the periodic table and their nature. On one question, I will discuss. So, in this discussion, I would like to just give you a small idea about uh, the third period elements. What are exactly the third period elements? So, I am going to just write third period elements. What are exactly third period elements? So, we start with the sodium metal, sodium, magnesium, okay, aluminium, silicon, okay, phosphorus, sulfur, chloride. So, you can uh, observe these elements in the period, uh, periodic table, in okay, the third period of the periodic table. So, if you ask anything regarding this oxides of third period elements, sodium forms oxide Na2O, magnesium forms MgO, aluminium oxide is Al2O3, silicon oxide is SiO2, phosphorus oxide is P2O3, phosphorus pentoxide, phosphorus trioxide, sulfur oxide is sulfur trioxide. Chlorine oxide, chlorine heptoxide, Cl2, was In this, chlorine oxides, in this last three P block elements list, we have the most acidic nature will be observed. So, what is this uh, nature of the compounds? Means when we are going from left to right in this period of oxides, uh, acidic nature in this direction increases increases and uh, it starts with basic nature first two are uh, belongs to alkali and alkali earth metals uh, they are uh, basic in nature basic in uh, nature and when it comes to the middle oxides they are uh, said to be amphoteric oxides amphoteric in nature so that means basic nature decreases acidic nature increases from left to right so Right to left, if you take uh, this basic nature, is said to be increases in the third period of elements. So, if they ask anything from this, you can have a plan on this uh, period elements and the corresponding oxides like this, uh, and you can start practicing questions like this. And even silicon also you have a bit of acidic nature, but aluminium silicon. And their corresponding compounds it exhibits amphoteric nature also. Okay. Let us uh, uh, have a look on these compounds uh, and these compounds. I am sure that you are going to prepare these compounds uh, properties in the exam. And you can also refer the previous examination questions on this uh, topic. Hope you understand this small video. We will meet in the next videos on uh, regular discussion of uh, our YRKS classes uh, of chemistry classes in this YouTube uh, uh, class. We have YouTube uh, um, playlist I will every day and try to upload. Okay, thank you very much.